Hello, Wastelanders, Wanderer here. Welcome back. There's a robot shooting at me. He's no longer shooting at me. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Horizon, where robots shoot at you while you're trying to do your intro. We're back over in Cambridge and just going to try to finish up clearing it out today. Uh, we got all the raiders in the... Um, the kind of lower eastern part of it cleared out, so that should be done. What time is it actually? Eh, it's pretty late. It's a bit late at night. Maybe I'll drop off the power armor and go sleep uh, somewhere. I could sleep over at... Uh, you know, clip this out already, so this is all done. Um, I could cross over here and then go to Hangman's Alley and sleep there for the night. Could drop the power armor off as well at the bridge and then just sprint across, save myself some time and some fusion core. Because we are a bit low on fusion core. I mean, we're not low overall. I just don't have... Oh, great. That's wonderful. Um, I just don't have any with me. Did something go flying and just dump into the water over there? It sounded like it. I think that mine sent something flying. Oh yeah, this is not a functional bridge, is it? Maybe you can cross here. Eh. It's a bit iffy. I mean, if I mess up is the issue, right? Like, if I don't make it? I'm pretty sure I can make that no issue. I'm um, pretty sure I can make that too. It's pretty deep at that point, and I don't really want to really screw up and end up in the water would be a long, irradiated walk back, and there is a lot of people in turrets. One. Two. Three. And four. Counting with 50 cal. It's like Sesame Street, but for adults. That went pretty well. Oh, I'm out. I, uh, yeah, oops. Click. Nothing happened. Do I have 4570? I have none. Alrighty, do I have 308? Pretty sure I do. You could just hold still there for a moment, sir. Thank you. That guy sometimes has a, um... Uh, what's it called? A missile launcher. Would not make us have a very good evening. Now, I think I'm done. I'm pretty sure that's everybody... I believe I've killed everyone on the way I would possibly meet, so from uh, here on out, can hopefully lock the power armor and just go back on foot. Just have to remember where it's at. Okay, it didn't show up on the map for some reason previously, one time when I locked it. I thought it was because it was locked, maybe? Oops, gas mask. That could have been sold for some caps. More efficient to sell it, probably. Don't understand this. There's a there's I guess like Zaw doesn't want you to have a missile launcher, <coughs> so he uh, he takes the missile launchers out of the game. But then there's a there's just a missile there. It's like missile launchers are too good, you can't have one, but they're really not that good in Horizon. I mean, they're okay. But against the stuff you'd think they'd be really good against, which is like really big, scary stuff, they're like the stuff you save them for, you know? Yeah, they're not very good. 
running out of the power armor so I could run. So I should actually do that. And Hangman should be right around the corner here. Okay, and I haven't done too much of this place yet, right? Like, let me check. At least our happiness is going up a little bit. Um, so that's nice. I don't think I ever got a recruitment station going here because I didn't have the um, the stuff for generator, which I finally have now, so I'll go ahead and do that. Apparently my surface snap is just not going to work up here. We'll just pretend it's working. So there's that. We're hooked up there. Got some food, but no water. We have plenty of beds, though. The beds are over around here. Oh, holy shit. Yeah, I can tell it recruited six settlers since my last visit. They all just came marching in through the side here. All right, well. You guys want stuff to do, I take it, huh? I don't know what to give you to do, though. I mean, I do I do have a vendor contract. I can check Diamond City 2 and get more, I suppose. But yeah, that's what we're going to do here. Just a bunch of vendors, I think. A bunch of street vendors. Hangman's Alley, the alternative to uh, Diamond City for all your shopping needs. Friendlier staff. Moderate income. Moderate. I want a high income. So I'll start with a general store here, I guess. Um, I want to. I probably want these all to like line up, so I want enough room. You know what I mean? Let me see if that works. They, they all snap together, so I do want them to snap. That works. Okay, and uh, the rest of you lot, you need stuff to do, I guess, but I don't really have anything for you to do right now, so... I mean, I can I can do stuff like this, I guess, but there's no room for it, really. Don't need lumber. Don't need stone, really. Um, don't really need more junk. I could do power surplus, I guess, but I'd rather put those in sanctuary because it's pretty close to already being an industrial park, so... I don't know what to do to keep you guys happy. Chemical factories, no, I don't think I have one of these. Allows you to create chemicals. Hmm. Nice, I still don't have the workshop tech level for that. It's a bit large for here, though, you know? I'm thinking I'm just going to do all vendors here and nothing else. I think they're just going to have to go without a job for right now. I think that's the... That's how it's going to be. Now I'll go shopping for more uh, vendor thingies in the morning. Can't believe I haven't found Cricket yet. Because she'll have a vendor contract on her, too. I need to get more of the... I need to get the... Um, I need to find where the, um, where the things are for, uh, caravan, not the travel hub, but the caravan, the thing that, can you jump out here? You can, you totally can. And then it's like, ends right here. That's so cool that he's done that. It doesn't really have any huge issues with FPS or anything. So where's it end? It's like right here. Yeah, it's like right out the, outside the window. That's cool. Just curious. The things that the um, the vendors come to and they will stand there and whatever. Do you have a vendor contract? No, you don't. This is a shared... Whoa, you got the canister now. 1,000 gunpowder. And the 500 box. I guess that's because I have a higher trading level now. And a whole bunch of caps. Holy smokes, you got a lot of caps. Um... I'm going to make, if I can, I'm going to make a, um... Actually, I can do it. 
I don't think it matters. I think I can, I think I can trade the person at home plate, right? It shouldn't matter too much. In fact, I could probably fast travel to home plate, and that would be quicker. Do I have a travel hub here? Gonna say probably not. Let's make one then. Utilities, travel hub. Right there for now. It's backwards. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Home plate. Let's go. I do have a resource station over there, so I'll check my resource station for production as well as um, sellable stuff. Yeah. Now, that was the armor guy, so like... Yes. Huh. Hi. Or was it this guy? I'm new around here. I wanted to personally thank you. Okay, I don't care. I'm gonna I'm shoot to you in the face if you keep talking to me. I don't think we've met. What can I do to help <clears> out? <throat> Looking for a weapon? There we go. I couldn't barter sure. before. Let's take a look. Here's what I've got. Okay, yeah, they share the same inventory. Although this one has less money. No, they don't share the same inventory. Never mind. The other one has way more stuff. Other one has way more stuff. It has a thousand gunpowder. This one only has a hundred. So I guess I can go to all my settlements. I think they have a shared... Um, let's get this stuff out. Uh, yeah, take everything. Nice hernated vendor credits, not bad. Maybe I could carry some of that for you. Just looking at stuff here. Gonna dump all this stuff off. Because it'll all go back eventually. On its own, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Uh, there's that. Actually, I can sell a lot of this stuff. Um, and what I can't sell, I'll, uh, yeah, this stuff is nice, but it's not as good as the heavy combat armor. I think it's actually pretty similar as far as, um, how much it gives you. I don't know, know it's actually an upgrade. Maybe some of it is, but I don't think most of it is. Gonna scrap all this stuff. Alright, let me just go through scrapping some of this stuff and, um... So let's see, field kit. Oh no, back. That's not what I wanted. Field kit. Field scrapping. So yeah, I'm not going to do these because, not the Institute stuff, because they I won't get the proper stuff out of them. I won't get the nuclear material out of them. This doesn't matter, but the Institute ones I don't want to do. Those can all be sold. That can be sold. This stuff, um... That's actually braced. I can use that. I just don't care that much about that stuff. I guess I should do that. I should scrap it at the station, though. I literally can't scrap this stuff. Or I couldn't scrap the uh, power armor at the station, so I'll just scrap it here. It's fine. No, this stuff actually matters where I scrap it. Okay, rest can probably be sold. That's fine. Give it a second here. Okay, and then let's look at our storage here for stuff we can sell. I think I want to keep all that. Um... Some of the stuff I want to keep because it's like the only thing I have of it. Like I, I'm only gonna find like one Ripper or one Super Sledge or one Junk Jet, and maybe I'll find out it's really good or something. And I should use it, you know. Uh, the robot stuff, you know, I'm thinking I can probably scrap the combat. Well, no, the combat armor is better. It's actually significantly better. So now I'll keep the combat since it's heavy combat armor. I'll keep it. 
all this stuff. We're going to find more of that, um, more of that stuff. So I'm just going to keep, I'm just going to sell all this stuff. More of the robot stuff it is. Unless it scraps for a whole bunch of really good materials, let me see. So if I'm scrapping robot, what does it give me? Steel and mixed ally scraps. I mean, th that's good, but like... I think I'd prefer caps right now, or would I? Eh, it's a hard choice. Huh? Yes? Yes? Let me see if I can max this guy out for caps. Easily, or if it's going to be hard. If it's difficult to do, then... Oh, yeah, I don't want to sell these. I want to scrap these for nuclear material. Or do I? I mean... Yeah, probably just scrap them for material. Calibre compensated scoped. Yeah, I'm just going to sell that. Uh, quick mag scoped. Yeah, I'm going to sell that. All this stuff I can sell. It's only selling for three, but that's... I mean, it's not bad. That's yeah, a fair amount of caps. I have more of that stuff I can sell too. I didn't get all of it, I don't think. Some of these I can just sell too, I think. Like, as long as I have one of each. I don't think I'll use an Assaultron head or torso either, so I'll just sell those. Missiles I can break down. They sell for quite a bit though. I don't know. They do sell for a lot. All right, that works. We got new guys here too that we gotta figure out what they're gonna do. So let's take the brace off of this. Then, uh, yeah, we'll just scrap it. The combat armor gives a lot better stuff. Alloy scraps, carbon fiber, ballistic fiber scraps, yeah. Combat's really good to scrap. Should definitely scrap all that all of that that I can. And then uh, these things gotta scrap those too. So if I scrap this, yeah, so no, we're not actually. We're not getting we are getting fiber optics and crystals and stuff. I don't think we get all this stuff. It's worth scrapping for the advanced circuitry alone though. These things are. Every single one of those, I should be scrapping it, probably. It's probably why I'm so low on advanced circuitry, is because I didn't scrap those, I sold them. Which I think, in retrospect, is probably a mistake. I can make an advanced capacitor on this now, and I have plenty of nuclear material, you know? I have 120 science, I'm surprised. Um, is it worth doing that? Well, 180 is quite a ways away, I think, right? Let me check, but... I think we're just barely at 120 if we're at 120. Um, I need to look at my field kit. Skills menu. Science. Yeah, we're just barely at 120. So, and like, I'm not going to get 180 science anytime soon. It's going to be a long time until I see that. Like, even to get my next ranks of nuclear physicist, which gives me a little bit of science... Um, gives me 10 more, I think, and then this one gives me 20 more. I guess that's 30 more. It's, we're still going to be short by, like, 30. Which we're going to need to make up with just crafting stuff or whatever. So, like, we're a long ways away is basically what I'm saying. So I think it's worth probably going ahead and upgrading our energy weapon. wonder why these are out of order. But yeah, Amplified is uh, better than Boosted. This also requires Future Soldier, which I may not ever get. I don't know. Like, I might just might not ever get that. So yeah, we'll go ahead and do this. I think it's worth it. 100 nuclear material, but 6 extra damage is pretty significant. This just gives burning damage, which I don't really like that much. Plus, it's like, eh, it's not that great. This doesn't really recoil enough to worry about the stock. Um, 
I'm fine with using the fine-tuned beam focuser because it gives me a lot more range plus the reduced recoil and everything else is uh, is fine. 43 per shot on the fusion cells, not bad. If it was automatic, this thing would freaking shred. Like, it would be pretty damn good, but when it's automatic, oh man, does it, uh, like, it, it just, the recoil becomes awful on it, so I'm good with that. Um, this thing is hardened. We can upgrade it to powerful now. Um, advanced is not that far away either, though, which, it, like, it's a double. So what's the cost? The main cost here is going to be adhesive, and, um... I don't care anymore, guys. I've got 200 adhesive, apparently. Like, I don't know where I got that extra 100 from. I was at, like, 70 last time, although it may have been because I had a bunch in my... Um... I had a bunch of junk in my my production storage and doesn't count that because it doesn't use it right. So, but let's see, how close am I to 140 ballistics? Um, I can't get gun nut until 20, which we're not that far away. It's two levels. I unlock markets here as well. I'm going to want to do this eventually. Um, but let me see what my skills are at here. Uh, let's see. Ballistics, we're at 106. So, yeah, it's going to be a while. Because the next one is, what, 140? Yeah, there's no way I'm getting this anytime soon, like, easily. I might get Trooper eventually, but yeah, I think... I think it's worth doing the powerful upgrade for now, I suppose. Like, none of this stuff is that pressing that I can't use it. Like, none of it's that important I can't use it to get a, a nice damage boost here. That's gonna significantly increase my, um, 7.62 damage on it, too. Right now, this thing... It's pretty far behind... Like, at 7.62, it's 62 damage per shot. Compared to this thing, which is 79 per shot. Um, granted... Like, ammo cost-wise... Uh, energy, here we go. So, it takes... 140... Takes no, it takes it only take it takes seventy two cells per ten fusions per ten heavy fusion cells. This is like some of the most efficient damage I can do right now, guys. 72, 72 energy per ten heavy fusion cells, and each one is seventy nine damage per shot. It's really really good. Like it's really very reasonable. When you compare that to, say, like, um, 7.62, which is 148, it, it's about even. Um, these are, they cost about the same thing to make. So I get 20 for 148 smokeless powder versus 10 for, like, 70-something energy cells. They're about the equivalent. The heavy fusion cells are about the equivalent of a 7.62, but it does significantly more damage. So what I'm saying is, I'm going to be using a lot more... I'm going to be using that a lot more, because I've got plenty of materials for it. Um, there's going to be 10, which is going to be... Um, 100 should be. So we'll just do all these. And I need to do um, the rest of my field kit. Let me see. Because you can convert every single one of them in your field kit if you go to utility crafting. And then convert fusion to heavy. And uh, then just hit all of them. And you get everything there. So, cool. Uh, let's see how much I've got there. That gives me 150, 149 heavy fusion cells. Pretty good. Still have plenty left in there. I'm going to dump this excess in here. Um, that's what we're going with for right now. Um, far as 
disassembly. We can do all of these. All the 45s. All the 10 mils. 12 gauge, even 5.56. Not going to use it. Cryo, no thank you. I wouldn't mind having some more frag grenades. Need six explosives to make that. A little bit off. Um, I could make baseball grenades, and those are pretty good too. Uh, I don't require that much to make. I've got plenty of parts probably for that. Pipe bombs are crappier. Don't want to make those. But baseball grenades are pretty reasonable, and it's going to give me skill, right? That's the big thing. It's going to give me skill. That's the biggest thing. Then for ballistic, um, do I want to go 50 cal? Yeah, I want to make some 50 cal. I think basically what I'm going to do for now, guys, I'm going to use 50 cal pretty much exclusively. For sniping. So hunting rifle is for sniping. Let me let me check the hunting rifle too, actually. This is already powerful. I'm pretty sure this is the highest I can go. Yeah, 120. I can do more at the higher levels. So uh, this is going to be for sniping. Just need stealth skill to get that. What is my stealth skill at? Hold on. Like if I put... I'm just curious if I put one point into sneak, if I'd be able to get that. The suppressor, because the suppressor would make me a lot more stealthy. I could get away with a lot more shots before people found me if I was stealthy. Nice, got a salt shaker. Can't do any of those, I guess. Um, right. Field kit. Skill menu. Looking over stuff here. Actually, if I get one point into stealth skill, I can make a suppressor. I guess because I sneak so much, I've just got... Because I haven't put anything into stealth at all. I've not touched sneaking yet. That's all from magazines and from sneaking in the world, basically. If I do that... Check again here. And we should be able to put... Really? Are you sure, game? I'm going to have to probably force it to update here one second. So I'm pretty sure I am. Pretty sure I am uh, stealthy enough for that. Yeah, I definitely am. Unless it requires something else I'm not aware of. I don't know. There we go. Just had to update. Okay, so yeah, we're going to do this. So now we got a suppressor, and that doesn't even lower the range at all. So, uh, yeah, I noticed my range went up to 414, which I guess is because my sniping skills improved. Then we'll swap this back over to 50 cal. What a nice sniping weapon that is. Marksman we can't do unless we have the sniper rank 2, which maybe I'll think about getting that because... Uh, this doesn't really change much, though. Sight accuracy doesn't change. Stability is a tiny bit better, but I don't really care that much about stability. Like, you just hold your breath. It's not a big deal. Can do a large quick eject mag on that as well. And I'm going to say, why not? Um, no reason not to. This is, like, better in every way. And it does, you know what? Like, it doesn't cost anything to make it. So I'm just going to do it. I'm going to be entirely honest, guys. The reason why I want the Marksman stock is because it makes it look so much cooler. Like, that's the main reason why I like the Marksman stock. The cutout on this, like, it just freaking looks cool, okay? That's the reason why I like it so much. Not because it's really all that better in actuality. Okay, uh, that's fine. This is, this is fine. 
and I'll think about crafting one of these in the near future. So that's good. Um, I'm not going to really use this at all. I'm going to use my laser rifle instead and my hunting rifle. Um, I think I'm going to actually... I'm pretty used to using three for my hunt, my rifle, so I'm going to probably leave it on, on that for now. Uh, next question, can I make any animal stew? Yes, I can. Go ahead and grind up our meat here, our meat scraps and stuff. Things that we can't use for other stuff, that we know for sure we can't use for other stuff. Um... So this stuff isn't bad, it gives you nice bonuses, but like they're not that big of a deal. Now the Mirelurk cake... Okay, I don't want to use that yet because it uses Razor Green, but that's actually very useful. This gives you straight up 100 AP. It's pretty cool actually, the Mirelurk egg omelette. And um... Just straight up gives you 100 AP, like it's really useful in situations where you have to have AP, you know? It does require a lot of really expensive materials though, so I'm gonna pass on that for now. Okay, uh, it's fine for now. Let's see if one or two of these can take care. Yes, they do. Good. And what's our addiction? This is just still a jet addiction and a mentats too. Okay. I didn't use a mentats to talk to my guy and sell stuff, which uh, feels bad, but it's whatever. It's not a big deal. Okay, so we got a bunch of uh, baseball grenades. And those don't do bad damage. Like, 110 is enough to kill somebody pretty easily. Like, that's that's lethal with one throw range, which is what we, what we want. Like, pipe bombs are not, which is why I don't really like using them. But baseball grenades, they do enough damage that you can kill somebody in one shot with those. All right, so we've got this thing. I've never lost anyone before. This got failure is new to me. lots of shots for this. We've got um, this thing. Which we've got quite a few kills for this too. I did go through this pretty fast though. I might make a few more uh, 50 cal rounds. And that ought to be good. And then we can... I guess we don't have to heal just yet. We're a little bit low on health, but we're okay. I'm going to dump a lot of my extra stuff that I want to go back to Sanctuary... Actually, I can dump it here, and it'll just go back there. Yeah, that's right, so... I'll just put it in here for now, I guess. Pipe bomb, don't want that. All this stuff can go back. Now, I am going to be a bit short on food here soon, so I want to go and talk to Shang at some point. I mean, I can just do it now, I guess. Do I have a bunch of missiles in my inventory? Yes, I do. All this stuff can probably just go back. If it's not uh, 308, 50, or... Um, I'll keep the 7.62. Or uh, heavy fusion yeah. cells. I don't like, want it all that much. Yeah. Okay, yes. uh, let's go. I could go back. I might just fast travel to... Um, Mother settlement over here, Hangman's Alley, and get all the gunpowder out of the vendor there. And the energy cells, too. Like, energy cells are, like, I think my bread and butter right now. Well, those in 50 cal. They're both really good. He does not have his stuff back yet. That's fine. Uh, where was I going to go out here? Nothing to see here. I could cure my addictions too. Let me see how much it is. The patient. Mm hmm. Yeah. Tell me your symptoms. You don't have cures. We can sober you up. Sure. Oh boy. Oh, okay. This is the supplies. Okay, so. Um. What's it cost to cure everything? Oh fuck, it didn't... Oh, it was up here. Ooh, god, I just spent like a thousand caps... ...on god. that. Now, was there anything else bothering you? Oh god, I didn't mean to do that. I just blew like half of my caps to hey, cure... Hmm... Right? I didn't mean to do that, guys. Matt. Hey, lady. 
That interview you did with Piper is really selling. Here's your free copy. I'm not going to reload. I didn't I didn't look at the menu properly, and I'm a moron for not doing it, but uh, it is what it is. Um I should talk to Nick. What have they been listening this whole time? Hey, hey, quiet, swatter, all right? Who needs a swatter? Yikes. Protection for sale. Hand tooled pieces. Let's get this quest started too. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. It's important. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Okay. I don't know that I'll uh, do that right away, but... I don't mind getting the quest. It is 200 experience, so you might as well, right? What the hell? Oh, I was gonna get, I was gonna get water from hey, Shang. Hey, that vault dweller from the paper. Yeah, yeah. Stop gawking, lady. All right, give me your water, Shang. It means a lot to me in my business. You just shut up and give me your water. You're out of water. Well. Poo -poo. We gotta get some experience then. We gotta get to level 20. I'm gonna go back into home plate and fast travel to like Hangman's. Drink. Dug out in's got some cold ones. Maybe they have some too. Some uh, water. There's a lot of side quests that I could do right now, but I just don't Multi feel content. like doing them. <laughs> Protection from Commonwealth weapon Maybe later. I don't know about you guys, but like when I have, when there's like all these side quests, they're great, but it's like when I think about doing them, I think about it like a checklist that I have to complete. And uh, it, it kind of feels bad in a way. Like it makes me not want to do them because I think about all the work that is involved in doing each of them. Maybe I'm weird though. Um, so yeah, Hangman's Alley it is, and then we'll run up and get our power armor and continue exploring. I know I've spent a lot of time in base today. Apologies for that. And then, uh, we gotta pray we, like, Shang restock soon, because we're about out of water. I mean, I can survive off sanitized water, too, but it's very inefficient to use, uh, to make sanitized water. Really, it's really a stopgap until you get to, um, the workshop tech level you need to make purified water yourself. And, unfortunately, um, we're still a ways off. Have to be level 20 for it. Like, every perk... To get to that level, it, it just seems kind of hard capped behind 20 in Desolation Mode. It's much, much easier. That's probably the biggest change. If people, if you want to know, like, what the biggest change is between uh, regular Fallout 4 uh, Horizon and Desolation Mode, the biggest change is probably the fact that Purified Water is so freaking hard to get in Desolation. The Purifier module being locked behind Rank 8... I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's intentional, but, like, it being locked behind rank 8 just is... It's really bad. It's really, really rough. Definitely is, like, the hardest thing about this. Uh, I don't think there's anything under here. Went across. Oh, here's a power armor, okay. Well, that was a very expensive cure, but I, I guess we're all good to go now. I'll try not to use any drugs. Shh. 
sure there are plenty of people IRL who would pay. Oh, we didn't repair our power armor. Shoot. I should have brought it back so I could repair it. Ugh. Am I really that dumb? Yes, I'm really that dumb. I mean, the arm's blown off. You know, uh, it's fine. Just missing one arm and our other arm's almost blown off. It's fine. I'm just going to adventure like this and I'll fix them later. Did I, do I still have my arm? I didn't, like, scrap it, did I? Oh, I definitely, I definitely, um... I don't know if I scrapped it, but I definitely put it... I definitely sent it back to Sanctuary, because I'm a moron. You guys were yelling at me, I'm sure, the whole time. Well, Wanderer's a dum-dum. Yet again. It happens. I'm not too worried about it. I can always make another one. I have plenty of spare materials now. Mistakes are bound to happen. I'm not gonna beat myself up, and you shouldn't either. I need to get my water mod again. I had a water that looked really, really good. It was like a water mod for ENBs, and... Water doesn't look bad now, but it looked way better with that mod. Not really even comparable. Oh, hey, dude, I, I forgot to loot you, I think. Yeah, I did. Didn't see you earlier, I guess. So, yeah, we're almost done here. God, voice cracking. We're almost done here. I went through all this stuff already. Trying to think what else we need to go through over here. I mean, we're, we're pretty well done. Anything over here? Looks like no. There was that ghoul that I shot earlier. Bunch of you are probably also wondering when I'm going to modify uh, Ada. And the question is whenever I get around to going back to Sanctuary, basically, because I'm not going to go out of my way for it. I don't rush off to do stuff. Unless it's the big, big benefit, you know? And that's not that big of a deal. This is uh, Hightower's place. Ticondria, yeah. How do you say it? Kytondoro Ticonderoga. Okay. Not Ticondria. What's Ticondria? Is that like a place? I have no idea. Just a word that's in my head. Sometimes, you know, your brain auto-completes stuff. If it doesn't recognize stuff right away, it's just like, oh, that's that's this. Mmm, that nice, that nice suppressed shot. Nobody's any the wiser. Feels good. God dang, I did it again. How do I keep doing this? It's only when I hit vats. It's only when I'm in vats that that happens. Where does this go? Is this the back entrance to um, the scavengers, the crazy scavengers by the boat? That's oh, this is Monsinger Plaza. Okay, well, I'll, I'll go through and clear this out. That's fine. Oh yeah, there's a bunch of rads here. I can't- I changed my mind, I don't want to go through here. There's a ton of rads. Just spent all that money getting Nora cleaned up, you know? 
Don't want to get her messy. Thousand freaking caps. Can't believe I did that. So stupid. I thought I had like one more menu to go through. Like I thought it'd be another menu and then it would tell me, are you sure you want to do this? You're going to pay this amount of caps. But no, it was just like, boom, you're done. You spent all the caps. But life savings, man. Or half of it anyway. It's okay. Our trading is going to ramp up pretty quickly here. You know, I went back to Diamond City specifically to get uh, bartering contracts or vendor contracts. And I, I forgot to get them. I just didn't get them. Oops. I'd say it's not my fault, but it, it definitely is. It most certainly is my fault. Gonna go buy this mine. Upside down frag mines. You know, sneaky. Get all these frag grenades, or these, yeah, these frag grenades, I can make them into bottle cap mines, or um, baseball grenades. Frag mines into baseball grenades. That is what I should have said. What I meant to say. Oof. If that was frost, I'd be dead. I don't fucking see it! Pretty sure that was... Maybe I'll look back in the recording and I'll see where it was, but I'm... I didn't see that at all. I, I think it was below the debris there. Below the textures or something. Oh my god, Ada has no arms. There's a bunch of mut mutants over here too. I don't see any out right now. Time to laser some faces. This is bullshit. You're bullshit. Okay, I need higher ground here. Motherfucker! Oh, now it's on. Really? Where the hell did you go? Ada, did you fucking give my cover away again? It's Nightkin. I see you, Nightkin. We may have an enemy nearby. Oh, that's a. And the leg's almost broken. Freaking mutant hounds. They break your legs so fast. I do actually prefer to not blow those guys up now because you get no more nuclear material by, um... by breaking down the thing. I have no ammo for this. I shouldn't be using it. Ooh, 50 AE revolver, huh? I mean, I could make one of those myself, I guess. It's not that good technically, but it's why it hurt, I guess. Huh? Prepare to be alive! Oh. 
Oh my god, Ada, you don't have a stealth mode, do you? Like, you, you just alert everyone that we're here. I'm about ready to send you back to Sanctuary just because you're so freaking unstealthy. Let the whole place know we're here, why don't you? Dog meat wasn't so unstealthy as Ada is. Go fight them then, Ada, you dummy. Yeah, because I shot her in the face and turned her into a pile of ash. You're doing nothing for me. I know I can upgrade her. I always get so annoyed with companions. You just can't live up to Eddie and Boone. The best bros ever. That's the real issue. And I admit it's tough to live up to that level of greatness, you know? Tell you what, Ada, you don't do anything for me at all. Like, there's no reason to have you here. So, you can go back to Sanctuary. Hey. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Ada. Please take your components, ma'am. Well, thanks, I guess. Hey. How? Yes. How can I assist? Hey. I want you I to have new orders, go. Yes. Um, is there no option to send her away? Oh, dismiss. Yeah. It's time for you to go. I wouldn't recommend. Yes, go to Sanctuary Hills. Get out of my sight, Ada. All you do is tip people off to my location and get me shot at. Make me use more ammo because I don't have sneak attack damage. I'm happier when you're not here, and when I'm happier, my viewers are happier. So, go away. Antibiotics, nice. She can hack for you, which is like one reason to keep her around, I guess. But I have auto hackers for that purpose, so. And you get her so late in the game that, in my opinion, it's not worth trying to save this, the perk points for that, you know? Because you're going to want to open turrets before that. Okay, so I think we're clear in this area, ready to proceed to the next level. Ooh, Sanctuary is actually under attack. This is my first time I've had something under attack. There's one over there somewhere, they might be sleeping. And there might be one in here. There's a trap in here for sure. 
There's some amazing poetry in here, too. I'll read you guys in a second. Look who I am. Is it worth a buy? I wonder if I could actually sell some adhesive for money. Hello. You know, staring at walls is not recommended. Oh, this was the boss too. Blacksmithing? Hell yeah. Combat Stimpact, Rebound, a nice weapon. Nice. Good stuff on this guy. stuff there too. Alright. Get a save in. Note to self. Next time I see Gri Griswold, shoot him three times. LOL. Touch this and die slowly, especially you Griswold. You can find Griswold's terminal over here. There is apparently a uh, Raiders Lovers spat. Griswold poetry. What? What is this? Oh, okay. Why is it not loading on life? It's not loading it. On death? There we go. Low to die, to kill, to maim. I really like to watch men die. I hope nobody kills me so I can kill them instead. On Sue. Sue is pretty. Sue is nice. Sue can shoot real good even at night. I love Sue. The end. Griswold, such a poet. On Griswold, low to be tough and handsome, low to be the best shooter ever, low to be Griswold, best raider ever. The end. Wow. On Sue, new. Sue is mean and not nice, that is why I shot her twice. Excellent. Makes sense. Huh, you can actually see out here pretty well, actually. Surprisingly, a lot of detail out there. I mean, you can tell it's not quite the real game out there. But that's actually kind of impressive. Okay. Put myself in a corner there, I guess. Whoops. That was a tripwire. I didn't remember that one. There's a bunch of rads here, but man, like, I'm too lazy. I'm just gonna go out this way. Get out. We didn't even start building a red bar there. We're fine. It'd be okay. That was a nice diversion. Uh, we're almost done with Cambridge. This is like the northern part. There's the, um... Uh, the Charleston area, basically, and uh, there's a nice laundromat in Charleston we can loot. has a bunch of stuff, uh, a bunch of antiseptic and some other good stuff there, gasoline and stuff. I don't know why it's gasoline, but whatever. Um, I can't recall anything else in that area of note, but we'll go up there and clear it out. But um, that might be next episode, and yeah, the next episode after we get that done... We really, 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 really need to go. Actually, I don't know. I, I might go straight to Sanctuary and try to save it because those timers are pretty rough. Like, if you don't get up there right away, you won't be able to defend it. I'd like to finish Cambridge, but it might not let me. Like, I might not have enough time to do that and go over there. So maybe, maybe I'll just be... Oh, yeah, there's the BADTFL. Right, BADTFL and uh, Charleston Laundromat over there. Maybe I'll just beeline. Pretty sure I can't get this yet. Nope. Yeah, I can't do those yet. But yeah, maybe I'll just beeline over to Sanctuary and get that done. After I do this.
Very surprised that wasn't a kill. Very surprised I'm still in combat. Ada. It's freaking Ada. She's not even my companion anymore. And she's still screwing me over. LOL. That double mutants falling out the windows is funny. Hmm, my friend just got headshot and died and fell out the window. I think I'll go and look too and also fall down and die. LOL, they're all doing it's so funny. They're all falling out the windows. Do 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 But yeah, it is not even my companion anymore, and she's still screwing me over by getting me detected. That was one hundred percent her fault. Oh my god, Ada, go home. Get away from me. You ruin everything. Yeah, so let me loot this real quick. There's an area below here too that has a chest in it, but like you have to wade through water for a long time and take on a bunch of rads and risk illness, so. Probably not going to do that. Getting a lot of 5.56 ammo. It's just not quite enough damage to headshot stuff and one-shot them with the, the hunting rifle. Not quite enough. If it was a tiny bit more... I think everybody I shot and killed in the upper floors fell down, so I shouldn't have to loot them or shouldn't have to worry too much about it. There's not a ton in here otherwise either. Like, there's really not. The top level goes to the highway and goes to, uh, there's a whole bunch of gunners and stuff up on the highway. It leads into Boston. It's pretty neat, actually. One of the things that Miniature Nerd talked about in his uh, Fallout 4 is better than you think video was the the success of the verticality but that really dropped my frames when I looked this way for some reason the successfulness of the verticality of Fallout 4 compared to previous titles and I do agree that like they did a great job like most Fallout games you really you really don't go up you know and um, that's one of the best things about having a like a big sprawling quote unquote uh, urban jungle you know, like this. My god, it tanks my FPS going up here, though. Hope it doesn't stay that way the whole time. It's because it's like rendering all the stuff in the background in Boston there, and I have my view distance pretty high. Might have to lower that a little bit. Okay, nice um, sniper rifle there. That's cool. Of course, with power armor, you don't have to worry too much about falling, which is great. I don't think I can make that jump, um, but I don't really care either because there's nothing there. This one, if I remember correctly, is just a bunch of vault tech boxes that you can't open. It's a master lock to boot, which makes you really sad. Yeah. Okay, there's, there's a vault tech chest back here, but... Okay, auto hacker, I guess. Not much there, though. Alright, guys. Well, yeah, we're going to call it here for this episode. Um, that's a mutant. 
but again we're gonna deal with it next episode I'm gonna check around up here in the next one and then we'll make a beeline back for a sanctuary so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time